it going everybody? Trey Hensley here. Uh, just wanted to make a quick video and explain the way that I play the tune Gold Rush. Um, if you have my course on Big Music Tent, Trey Hensley's Roadmap to Playing Fast and Clean, you will notice that I play this song in the course, but I do not go into it. Uh, I don't explain how I play it or anything. The reasoning for that um, is because the way that I play Gold Rush is largely based on the way Tony Rice played Gold Rush. Um, everything in my course, I wanted to be more solely based on the way that I play a certain tune or a certain lick. And so this song, um, and largely the, the way that Tony played it was just basically based on the melody, uh, the Byron Berline fiddle melody for this song. And um, But I still wanted to go into it a little bit uh, on this video because this one, this song in particular was such an important part of, uh, of my playing and a song that I really felt like I picked up a lot of uh, ideas and just the way that I play. I mean, right hand and left hand technique um, came a lot from this, just playing this song a bunch. This is one of my favorite tunes, and it's one that gets played in jam sessions a lot. Um, but I do want to take the time and say, if you do not have my course on bigmusictent.com, uh, there is a lot of useful information on there, and uh, it is all available for the low price of $30, and that's everything. I've had some people ask if it's a monthly fee. No, it's a one-time fee of $30, and you get all the videos uh, in the course, all the tablature, everything. Um, so check it out, but right now, I'll explain Gold Rush. Um, and so I'll go about it the way that I would play it if I was kicking it off uh, and playing it as a solo guitar piece. Um, so the way that I kick it off is a fiddle kind of kickoff, but it's one that I use quite a bit in other tunes, and it goes like this. So that picking pattern is just a 4 2 four two three four two three four two three, except for the... So it's a hammer-on to hit this open G string. So it's kind of a droning open G string. So now let's get into the A section of Gold Rush. It goes like this. So let me slow that down. It goes like this. even slower. You play that A section twice. So that is a uh, pull off. It's not two separate notes. And another one on the second string. So I do a slide on the fifth string to just kind of a droning uh, fourth string. So it's the same note. So again. That last section of the A part is. Now the B section, it gets a little tricky, um, and it goes like this. So slow down, that first part is. So it's a, hand, it's a, a pull off on the third string then it's not a pull off on the fourth string, so. And it's also important to note uh, the, the chord changes behind that, uh, behind that section. So if you were playing it, 
So it goes to C there, and you can hear that with the melody. So it's a quick C, but it still plays it in the melody. So let me slow that down. part there is something that I play a little different than the, the Tony Rice version. Uh, so it's that it's kind of a uh, Kenny Baker, Byron Berlon uh, sort of fiddle kind of double stop. But uh, yes. Yeah, so Here, there, there's a few things that you can do to embellish that melody, uh, and also you can either do the, the the pull off there, or you can play it as two separate notes. I do kind of both. That's another thing that I do to kind of embellish the melody is uh, sometimes I'll go to a, slick, a quicker slide. So here's another way to play it the original way. You can hear there's a hesitation there. So sometimes I'll go and do the. And that's another thing to note. Somebody asked about a picking direction on that. Um, so I still do the alternate picking when I'm doing the uh, individual notes instead of doing the, and I actually do it on both of them, but um, so there's the occasional time where I'll hit the third string on a downstroke. Most of the time it's downstroke on the second, upstroke on the first note of the third string. Let me play it all, the, just the one time through the A section and one time through the B section slow, uh, and maybe you can play along with it. That's the basic melody of Gold Rush. Uh, and that, again, is another important one that uh, I would suggest working on. And another thing, um, once you nail that part down, and again, I'll, I'll say this for everything, um, take it slow. Play the melody slow until you can get it all 100% right and then speed it up a little bit. Um, and another thing to work on is, once you nail that, go ahead and work on the octave version of it. keep you busy for a while <laughs> but uh, yeah I just wanted to make that quick um, basic melody of Gold Rush and uh, again I do have a full course um, that is full of tips and licks and tricks and all sorts of stuff uh, about flat picking guitar um, and in particular playing fast and clean um, and it's over at bigmusictent.com if you're interested in that go check it out Thank y'all very much. Now go play Gold Rush. <laughs>